सो हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू आवर यूट्यूब चैनल मेटलॉजिकल इंजीनियरिंग सो टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट सॉलिडिफिकेशन कर सो वेन वी हैव एन एलवा एंड दिस इज द टेम्परेचर एट विच वी पॉर दैट एलवा इन अ मॉल्ड सो दिस टेम्परेचर लेट से दिस टेम्परेचर रिप्रेजेंट्स योर पॉरिंग टेम्परेचर दिस टेम्परेचर रिप्रेजेंट्स योर पॉरिंग टेम्परेचर सो आफ्टर पॉरिंग द लिक्विड इन द मॉल्ड दिस इज योर कूलिंग रेट वॉट इज कूलिंग रेट कूलिंग रेट इज द डी टी बाई डी एस मॉल टी दिस इज द टेम्परेचर दिस इज टाइम सो चेंज इज चेंज इन टेम्परेचर पर यूनिट चेंज इन टाइम दैट इज द स्लोप ऑफ दिस लाइन विल टेल यू अबाउट द कूलिंग रेट सो द स्लोप दिस स्लोप रिप्रेजेंट्स कूलिंग रेट नाउ वॉट यू हैव टू नाउ दिस दिस हियर द टेम्परेचर इज कॉन्स्टेंट विथ रिस्पेक्ट टू टाइम वॉट वाई हेट वाई इट हैपन्स दिस रीजन आई एम टॉकिंग अबाउट दिस रीजन Why it happens? At this point, if uh, this is liquid, here it's solid. So at this point, solidification starts, and along this line there is solid liquid equilibrium. I will give you an example. When you put water in your fridge, uh, in your refrigerator, and uh, when you see that in bottle ice. starts making ice starts forming within the water what is the temperature of that water it's from 0 to 4 degree centigrade generally so there is ice water equilibrium equilibrium until and unless all the ice melts the temperature will be near 0 degree so at this point all the liquid is transformed into solid and at this point there is 100% solid then the temperature of solid starts decreasing and it comes to room temperature so this is again the region this region is again the cooling this the slope of this line represents uh, cooling rate which is again uh, change in temperature per unit change in time and it's not necessary that uh, slope of both the lines is uh, equal the cooling rate can be different so there are some uh, terms which is which is associated with this curve this 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 time range this is called local solidification time local solidification time that is the time at which the time this is the time at which solid starts forming and this is the time at which there is 100% solid this temperature this range this range is known as local solidification this time range is known as local solidification time local solidification time why that term local is here you will understand and this from this time to this time that is this time range the time at which you put your liquid metal in the mold and the time at which 100% solid is there this time range is known as total solidification time total solidification time so these are the two terms which is associated with this curve <coughs> now now what happens in real world exactly at this point this is your melting temperature tm this is melting temperature you can also call it solidification temperature if the temperature is equal to melting temperature then solidification does not start what is the reason you will see here you have to have some undercooling undercooling is the temperature uh, below your melting temperature at which you cool your sol uh, liquid for the start of solidification you have to have some undercooling this 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 temperature is your melting temperature Why the C at this temperature at T is equal to T M the gives free energy of liquid is equal to gives free energy of solid, and since the free energy of both the phases are equal, there is no activation for the formation of nuclei. So to supply some energy for the surface creation, let's assume that uh, and in most of the cases the nuclei which forms the it is spherical in shape. So there is some surface associated with this nuclei and that surface is associated with some surface energy which you have to supply so to supply that surface energy for the creation of uh, nuclei you have to undercool that 
लिक्विड सो वेन यू अंडर कूल द लिक्विड द गिव्स फ्री एनर्जी ऑफ सॉलिड विल बी लेस देन गिव्स फ्री एनर्जी ऑफ लिक्विड एंड दैट द चेंज इन गिव्स फ्री चेंज इन फ्री एनर्जी दैट डेल जी विच इज द इनर्जी विच इज रिलीज and that energy is supplied to the for the surface energy creation that's why there is undercooling this is the real world case this is just a ideal schematic of this curve and you know this temperature because of when one uh, once the solid uh, nuclei forms then uh, temperature remains constant unless and until 100% solid is form here and then this is again your this is again your uh, cooling cooling uh, cooling rate and this is so there are you have, uh, you can see that there are some points i have already uh, mentioned a b c d e f in this uh, curve so let's see that what each point represents so a b this a b is the specific heat removal that when the temperature of the liquid decreases in the mold there is some heat which is removed and that is Uh, and that heat is known as uh, a specific heat now this bc region is the undercooling you know that this is undercooling why undercooling is required i have discussed uh, just now and uh, that at c points c point the nucleation starts cd is the cd represent the latent heat of fusion cd this 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 curve represent the latent heat of fusion and when uh, latent heat is removed the temperature increases and this term is known as recalcitrance so what is recalcitrance it is the increase in temperature of an undercooled liquid metal as a result of liberation of heat heat during nucleation so when nuclei form there is some liberation of heat and due to that liberation of heat the temperature of liquid increases that phenomena is known as recalcitrance now d you can see here that uh, temperature is constant along this so you can say that uh, there here is uh, thermal arrest so whenever you see the term thermal arrest don't fear from it it just uh, representation of that uh, the temperature is constant at that time now the point e solidification is 100% that is you have 100% solid and ef is again i told you that it's cooling rate that is change in temperature per unit change in time and uh, its slope uh, if it has higher slope if 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 the slope is like this that means cooling rate is very high you are cooling it in uh, ice or cool water or if it's like this that is cooling rate is very slow so it's just uh, so uh, if you have any doubt uh, related to this topic you are always welcome in our comment section we will try to solve your doubt uh, as soon as possible so don't forget to like comment and subscribe our channel so thank you